Oh. And of course, Why hey. Why did they stop that in there? There you go. <laughs> they should yeah. have continued. No, Mike, they shouldn't have. <laughs> they shouldn't have. Why did they start it? We promised you, you guys. Started. <laughs> and we have her right here with us. We're excited to have Nigeria's, well, one of Nigeria's very first VJs, Pearl Elizabeth Amini Hart, popularly known as Pearl Cardi in yep. the building. Yay. She is an on-air personality, TV presenter, travel blogger, inf yeah. influencer, DJ, VJ, All of them. CJ, All MJ. Of them. <laughs> it's and good to have you. We just saw her video here for far. For far, yeah. Me. Let's let. Is it, is this or is that a natural career progression? Did you always want to sing, or uh, it's something like wow, when you've done VJ and you've presented? Like, like, I've done this for like I've done this for like forty years. Now. <laughs> Maybe let's I try know, something right? else. No, what? so the crazy thing about it is, growing up, mm. I felt like I was going to be an artist. Okay. But you know, as you grow older, you gotta need some money, you know, yeah. to Very sustain true. yourself. Very true. So I needed to get an actual job to be yes. able to, you know, survive and then go through everything go do else. What you want to do. So by the time it was 2020, during COVID, mm. during the pandemic, it's like a wake up call for everyone, I'm sure. You're right, you're yeah. right. I... So during that time, I just felt I just had to do it. Mm -hmm. You know, it's about time. It's about time. And it's, this is something that know. I, I know Nigerians don't really like. They don't like you. They, they just they like don't. you to remain in your place. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Because they come and say, what are you singing? Pe? Stay exactly. in your lane. I present. When you it's hear crazy. stuff, I, because I know. Yeah. I was talking to someone uh, when we were coming. I know that people will come after you and they say, look, no matter yeah. how good you are, they, they love people that when you see in one place, just remain there. If you're just an actor, be there. Act there. Don't come and sing. Do <laughs> what are, how do you deal with such stuff when you hear stuff like that? Um, truth be told, Mm. Honestly, 100%. I haven't got that from anyone. Not yet. Yes, not mm. yet. Okay. Exactly. Mm -hmm. That's the word. Okay. I can I can see them act like it, mm -hmm. but not really say it. Okay. So these days, I find that a lot of people are like, oh, wow, that's so lovely. You know, I get like a lot of good comments okay. about it. But, I, you know, in some areas, I just see some mannerisms, but... Mm. Nobody really comes out to tell We're me, that's fine, I that. love it. <laughs> We're going to talk about But first of all, you're not just a singer, you're not yes. just a songwriter, you also are a DJ as yes. well. I saw all of that, especially during the pandemic, yes. while you were locked up, you're doing some major DJ. I'm like, bro, what's so. going on here? When you learn how to do all of that, was it something um, just now? Okay, so about the DJing, I, I got myself a controller for my birthday. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, I think the previous year, that was probably 2019. Yeah. Mm. I felt, well, if you know me, you know I really love music. I music know is my thing. Mm. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> you know, it's just what I, it's just my whole life. So DJing was a nice way to create music when mm. I hadn't got into the studio. Okay. Okay. So that's how I got myself that controller. Mm. And then I got this guy, I'm like, you know what, I don't really know what button is what, but just show me what is what. Mm. And then I'll figure it so out. So kind of like you taught yourself how to do so, it. So yes, it's, it's, I did figure. Uh, yeah, mm. I did. But then now, recently, in the past couple months, I actually went to professionally learn. How oh to really? Do it. Here in Nigeria, you can yes. do it here in Nigeria. Wow. I went to KY's oh. Academy. I didn't know now. Big shout out to DJ. It's not a rocket So there's there's so much there's so much that you do, yes. um, especially with the whole VJ career. Mm -hmm. You're one of Nigeria's very first and very beautiful VJs. Let's <laughs> put that you. out there. Let's, I have one very interesting question that I want you to answer. Which question I'm, you I'm getting getting it. I know, right? You're asking about it. No, we can go through the process. Okay, let's ask this question. Now, I've I've always wondered, did you ever have a crush on me? No. Strange. It shocked me. As a human being, I was like, what? <laughs> Why? Oh, I don't, well, it's, I'm not trying to say. Wait, you're stammering, you're stammering. So. No, 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 no. I was going to say, you. you know what? I you know what why? Here. I was going to say, why would I have a crush on you? Uh, but I don't want it to sound it's like. All in a it's all jokes. It's all jokes. It's all jokes. Let's say why I asked that question. Marzino, no. you've been in the industry still 40 no. years. Wait, wait, wait. Still no. You've been in the industry 40 this years. Marzino's been in the industry 80 years. 80 years, still no. Not 18, 80. Bro, just take it as this has been one of my fantasies. So let's see what it's But that's fine. I'm I'm loving it. So let's go back to being that VJ thing. Yeah. Um, first of all, there's so many people who look up to you as being mm -hmm. a VJ here in, in Nigeria. When you see the young people doing what you've done from decades ago, how does it make you feel? Do you think that you've influenced VJ in Nigeria in any way, shape, or form? Yes, I do, actually. I, mm. feel, I feel like I've been able to put my print in mm -hmm. entertainment in Nigeria already so far. 
because I find, and I get a lot of DMs saying, oh, you're my inspiration. I nice. really love how you, you know, do this and do that. And sometimes I actually watch TV and I'm like, oh, I think this person's kind of sounding like I would. Hmm, mm. This is pretty cool. Mm. And, you know, but years back, I didn't think that that was cool. I felt that that was a little bit like, so why is this person acting like me? You know, <laughs> you know that type of Imitation is the best form of flattery. Flattery, exactly. Mm. So, you know, over the years, I now figured that, oh, this is quite cute. And I, I absolutely love it. I enjoy it. That's why now I'm trying to do something bigger, mm -hmm. something better, something that, you know, is What is much that? More what is that creative. thing you're trying to do? I'm doing music. Yeah. Okay. my video, So fam. when you, when you, <laughs> so there's the, the, the music, DJing and all of that. What, el what else might you just get into? Because you look like somebody who is just out to just, you know, go, go, <laughs> go out into, and which is one thing I like because it, yeah. not everybody, a lot of people have fantasies in their head. Mm. Mm -hmm. What I would have loved to do, but you are living it out. Look, no matter what people say you're putting yeah. out there, what else would you want to do or what else would you do in the next? Well, truth be told, my first ever career that I ever got paid for mm -hmm. was mm. acting. Ah, that was for real? The first ever in my life. I which, was, what, I was, was, it? what was it? What was it? I was, what, 15 or something? Mm. Okay. It, it was, uh, it was this movie, um, Kids at War. Okay. It was by Rosemary Ingby. She used to be okay. the producer yeah. back in the day when we were much younger. So I did that show and I was just part of the kids. And then after that, that movie rather. Uh -huh. And then after that, I was on another one, okay. um, Silver Spoon. Okay. Which is, I think, directed by Ndubisi Oko or something. Yeah. Your father is an actor. Yes, my dad yeah. is an actor. So, mm. yes. So it's, it's, it's something it's that I'm sure so from a yeah, kid, from it's growing really... up, it's something you'd um, yeah. have wanted to do. I, you have a tattoo there. I love it. I have it's a, a lot of tattoos. But Can this, we see all of them? This one. This you can see. Oh, oh come on, uh, Mazino. <laughs> what is going Oh, Mazino, you're yeah, really Fantasy. Fantasy. It depends but, on anyway. where they are. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my gosh. But this so, one I is have a lot um, of Ace of Hearts or what? This what, what is, is Sacred Hearts. This is Sacred Hearts oh, okay. tattoo. Okay. All right. Oh, I love so it. It looks like love. Let's Christian, let's yeah. let's stop love. You're not saying anything. We know we've not associated. Has Pell yes, been associated Pearl, exactly. Yes, Pearl, exactly. You know, uh, this is the question. Yeah, you are talking ahead of us. So it's like this <laughs> question. This is the question that everybody Everybody is caught one time or the other with somebody, it. but we've never caught you with anybody. Really? Yeah. So what's hmm. up? You don't have well, do have date night? Is, no, no, no. That's weird. <laughs> of course I do. The thing is, the thing is, I'm a very private person when nice. it comes to like, mm, private okay. life. Okay. So you only know what I put out or what I let you see. Mm. I don't put anything, any side comment. Mm -mm. Mm. All those ones are mine. How has that helped you mentally? Because we had that conversation this morning. Yes. Mentally, people who are out in the public, they have yes. certain pressures on them that makes them break down at certain times. Yes. We have the case of Absolutely. Michael, there was Shola. How Absolutely. does that help you mentally? Well, for me, um, keeping my private life private is like the most precious thing for me because mm. every time you put out something, you have, you give people the chance, liberty to say just about yeah. anything to you. And mm. it could And it could go crazy and it could just be, you know, or what you expect to control. as well. You may exactly. how you it's something it that you there. actually can't control. Mm. For people. And I like to be in control of everything that's oh. happening around me. Oh, I do. Oh, absolutely. Mike, stop. But I'm, not, but I'm not saying it in that way. I don't Bro, understand. Obviously, Today, I'm we're just, just having fun you with you. You guys are just... Oh, you love control. I'm enjoying it, too. I like your woman too. that likes control. You know? I'm enjoying it, too. Okay. Well, I like Listen. to control things uh -huh. because I don't want them to get out of hand. Mm. Okay. So with my private life, nice. I just keep it close to my chest. And truth be told, oh. I have my family... <laughs> I have my family. Bro, if I don't stop you, Mike won't stop. Oh, <laughs> I'll tell you what. I, today. I love